question. Alan Ward. <laughs> A.D. Ward. Yes. Two teams in the tournament. Won both conference tournaments. Um, exciting game today. The young ladies held on. Um, game yesterday didn't really have too much uh, mystery to it. But, I mean, do you feel like the genius of all geniuses or what? I had nothing to do with this. Uh, no, it, it's a remarkable weekend. Uh, it all starts with great coaches that uh, know how to lead their student athletes and get the most out of their talent. And uh, both of our teams are, are just, just resemble that totally. And to, uh, you know, it's not that easy, I keep telling everybody. And to come in here and accomplish something like they did uh, this weekend is a remarkable feat and something that our university will never, ever forget. Okay. Now, coming from Murray State, um, you've uh, you've been here before, yeah. um, and you look at Murray State, and when I think of Murray State, I think of them as kind of the one of the ultimate of mid majors, what they, they call are. mid majors. Um, what lessons did you bring from there, and um, impart upon your staff here at Abilene Christian? Well, the one thing that we're going to start doing uh, for the future is is take advantage of opportunities like this and capitalize on them. That's the first thing to build that tradition and that culture that you need. To be a household name as a mid-major, you've got to capitalize on moments like these. These are special, special moments, and our university needs to see that, and they will certainly see that this week. It'll be a week like they've never, ever experienced. And then to be able to build on that is, is what happens when you get to have a program like you have at Murray State, where you build on tradition and history, and then it becomes something that just happens year in and year out. Okay, now with that experience, again, at Murray State, that's a state school, mm -hmm. so it's a lot bigger. So what are the challenges of being a small Christian private university as far as uh, when it comes to recruiting and uh, getting your name out there? Well, certainly we're, we're a Christ-centered institution, and that's very important to us. Our faith is very important to us, and um, we certainly try to do everything we do for a higher purpose. Um, I think you've seen that today with the examples from Julie and from, from Joe last night, and, and that's part of who we are. But one reason I came here from Murray State is because I, I felt a lot of the same things. There's a lot of passion for our program. It's a very young program, very different than Murray State, which has been which has been established and won all those championships. But I felt like there was a lot of passion for it and something that we could build upon. And uh, people love this institution. And I think, oh, I know, all, all you're going to see is more and more of ACU out there because we're going to continue to win championships. All right. Well, as an athletic director, your game's always in season, mm -hmm. right? So um, as far as uh, I saw your men's team, and I see you got a lot of out-of-state kids on mm -hmm. that team. Um, what kind of recruiting challenges do you have, uh, and what kind of things do you use, uh, do you impart upon your coaches in that to sell the university to the student athletes? Well, it, it's certainly important that we find the right fit. I mean, you know, the student athletes that want to come to ACU and be part of what we're doing, uh, the academic rigor of the institution being a private institution which, with uh, you know, outstanding academic programs and high graduation rates, it's really important that we make sure that we find the right fit. But uh, we, we find kids that want to come to ACU and, and uh, if they're not part of you know what maybe our culture's been about, we want to make a difference in their lives, and we're here to support them no matter what it is. So um, we recruit nationally, uh, but we we just feel like the people that want to be part of our program can be a part of something very very special. Well, something tells me after this weekend, recruiting's going to get a whole lot easier. It's going to be a fun week, it's and I and I was telling I was telling our president to uh, get ready because the applications are going to start coming in. <laughs> right, so. right, exactly. Yeah. There's no better uh, ambassador for the university not than a, success in athletics. Not that at makes all. your job. Uh, so much more important. You're exactly right. Thank you, A.D. Ward. Thank you very I much. I appreciate, appreciate your congratulations it. to everybody. Now, uh, just don't fall asleep on us. No it falling asleep. Got, got a selection okay. so to yes, get ready sir. for so. All right. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank appreciate you so you. much. Thank, Thank you. you. All right. Alan Ward, Garage Apartment Media. We got to rush. Get down I-10 to go do our radio show. <laughs> I'm out. I'm out day. Follow the Garage Apartment on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Brand new tweet, photos, videos, hashtags. Let me share some real quick. Follow me on social media. And subscribe to the Garage Apartment Radio on YouTube.